What's going on guys? It's Brandon with SwoleDaddyDetroit.com and today I'm 12 weeks out from my upcoming men's physique competition and just wanted to share with you guys an update. So let's get to it. All right, so last week at 13 weeks out, I didn't do an update. There wasn't a whole lot of stuff to uh, to, to kind of update you guys on. So I decided that I would just combine that into uh, one update here at 12 weeks. Um, so last weekend, I did have uh, to battle with a wedding that was on the Saturday. Um, so that was a little bit difficult, you know, trying to contain myself and not drink and, you know, and, and stay sober and, and try to make sure I was, you know, eating right and all that stuff. And I think I did a pretty good job. I had a few drinks. Um, but I was still able to keep my total calories around 2,800 um, is kind of what I guesstimated because, of course, like at dinner, I, I couldn't exactly tell. But I think I did pretty good. Things stayed on track. So that was really great. I was proud of myself. Um, and then uh, the last two weeks, you know, weight still been coming off. So not this past week, but the week before leading into uh, week 13. Um, that was a really good week. I think I'd seen a low weight of like 193, 194. Um, and then it kind of like started to go back up, which was kind of kind of weird because calories were still stay staying the same, uh, 2,200 to 2,400. Uh, it's kind of been like the average. And um, so yeah, that was interesting. So last week, again, kind of stayed the same, like 196, 198. Um, but this Saturday when I uh, was 12 weeks out and I, I weighed in on that Saturday morning, uh, I was 196. Uh, which was good because I think the past two Saturdays I was like 198. So it was kind of good to actually see the weight go down on that Saturday a couple pounds. Um, so that was interesting. But what I think is happening is just kind of a, a body um, recomp. So I can definitely tell I'm getting leaner. You know, I've, I've been having my wife check me out and, and pose and, you know, she can see it too. So um, so I think I, I think it's just a recomp. I think that we're maybe adding a little bit of muscle. The fat's still coming off, but the weight's just not changing a whole lot right now. So we'll see how things go next week if we need to make any adjustments for uh, for calories or add cardio. But right now we're still doing uh, six days a week of cardio training, um, which is like a 10 minute warm up, then training, and then I do 35 minutes of cardio after that. So it's about 45 minutes of cardio in total. I don't think I'm gonna make any changes just yet, just kind of keep things going. Um, maybe starting next week at week 11 or 10, um, maybe decrease the calories a little bit. We'll start to increase cardio, you know, five, five minutes a week, 10 minutes a week. Um, and then maybe at, I don't know, 10 weeks, nine weeks, uh, we might even add in uh, the seventh day of cardio, maybe just 30 minutes on Sunday. And it doesn't have to be at the gym, you know, it's starting to get warm here. So maybe it can be a bike ride or a walk or a hike. Um, just to start to add in those extra steps, burn those extra calories. But things are going pretty well. Um, I also yesterday at the gym, since I was 12 weeks out, I decided I wanted to use the gym's in-body scanner. Um, so they have like kind of like a, a fancy scale basically, you know, and you put your hands on it, your feet on it, it, it measures your body fat and all that magic. And um, so that one's kind of cool. I've done that one before. Um, the most recent one I had done was a year ago. And so um, it was kind of a cool comparison actually. It looks like I've lost some body fat. Um, but, but also gain some muscle. So actually I'll go ahead and show you guys that right now. So let me take you to that. All right guys, so here is my in-body scan from today. So again, uh, at 12 weeks out, uh, my total weight 199.7 um, this morning. And basically it looks like we got about 24 pounds of body fat. So we probably need to lose 10, 12 pounds um, to be able to get down to, you know, let's say five, 6%. Currently this thing is stating that I'm at 12.2% which, um, I, you know, I don't know if I'm actually at 12.2, maybe a little higher, 13, 14, 15. But anyway, gives us a good idea. From this point on, I'm going to go 12 weeks, you know, today getting tested. Uh, we'll do it again at 10 weeks, 8 weeks, 6 weeks, 4, uh, 2. So we'll kind of go every two weeks and just kind of make sure this is working. Because um, the last couple of weeks, my weight was starting to kind of stall. It actually had gone up. Like last week, I'd had some um, uh, increases or some decreases down to like 193, 194. And then this week it kind of went back up. But I think what's happening is um, we're gaining a little bit of muscle mass. We're having some body recomposition that's taking place because I am looking leaner, even though the scale hasn't gone super down. Um, but today being 196 pounds, uh, where I think the last two Saturdays I've been like 198. So we're, we're definitely going in the right direction and we're still keeping calories pretty high, around 2,300 I think has been the average the last two weeks um, and still doing pretty minimal cardio. So things are still going well, but just to give you an idea from before, um, so this is kind of history over the last basically almost two years. This is like a year and a half ago. So, 
you know, weight's gone down and up from kind of bulking, cutting type deal. But uh, basically where I have the most muscle looks like back here, December of 20, but I was also, you know, 230 pounds. Um, so I think what's kind of the coolest one is this is from January of last year compared to like February now, so almost a year apart. And you can see the weight's almost the same, um, but we have about three and a half pounds more muscle versus last year. And then if you look, the drastic difference is the per percentage of body fat. So, you know, we've lost like three and a half percent body fat, but increased muscle, right? So that's a, a really awesome, you know, main gaining type of uh, type of thing. So that's really cool. So hopefully, uh, you know, this will keep trending downwards and maybe this will hopefully at least stay the same, if not go up a little bit over the next 12 weeks. Anyway, um, besides that, oh, we also had a, an NPC uh, competitor um, appreciation workshop yesterday. Um, so that was a free event that was put on, I think, by the by the NPC and by the promoters of these local uh, bodybuilding shows, and it was awesome. So we got to go there, and uh, they had like 10 or 12 IFBB pros that represented all the different categories, men's physique, um, there was bikini, open bodybuilding, all that kind of stuff. And so competitors got to come up there, talk to these pros, ask questions. Uh, there's actually some of the NPC judges that will be at some of these local shows were there. And so it was awesome. Like one-on-one, -on -one, we were able to ask them questions. Um, they let us go through posing and then critique our posing, which was really good. And then just kind of explain the whole process of posing because I've never done a show before, you know, so for me, this, this whole thing was really invaluable. Um, but uh, yeah, it sounds like for men's physique, it's easier than I thought. So basically you'll come out and there's gonna be like a little box and you stand in the box, you only have 10 seconds. And uh, should be basically just one front pose, turn around back and then back to the front. Uh, and that's it. And then you go off to the side, you know, and you have to maintain your pose. Um, but to be able to ask questions, you know, like what board shorts should I get? What color, you know, does it matter? How long? all that kind of stuff. And, and really a lot of the questions about the posing, um, the tips they gave us on posing that, hey, every day from 12 weeks out after your training, you know, go in your locker room at your gym and pose for five minutes, you know, get that practice. Um, so that was really good tips. Uh, super awesome stuff for me. Um, also this week I ended up shaving my chest, uh, which was kind of interesting. I, I don't think I've shaved my chest since I was like in high school or right out of high school. So it was actually a little bit demotivating. I feel like the hair kind of like, hid some of the fat. So to see it all bare, you know, it, it was really weird. Um, but, uh, you know, the kind of more motivating, I guess, too, because now I'm like, okay, there's definitely a lot more work to do here to, uh, to, to lean out. So, uh, but yeah, I'm enjoying the process. It's going really well. I mean, right now, calories are still kind of high, you know, 2200, 2400. So it's not really that hard to do right now. Cardio is still low. Um, but uh, we're going to continue on the same way. And uh, we'll see kind of how things go next week, if we start to see more of a drop or not. Um, if not, then uh, we'll make some adjustments. But I think with that in-body scanner uh, from the gym, I'm gonna use that tool now to kind of gauge progress and do that probably every two weeks. So we'll just kind of see, you know, that comparison of that 12.2% body fat, you know, at 12 weeks out, and hopefully we're keep trending in a, in a positive direction down and come in somewhere south of 10%, you know, uh, the lower the better. But being my first show and being that I've never even, uh, you know, gotten this lean before, um, I, I'm not putting, you know, I, like it would be awesome to come in at 5%, but to be realistic, this is my first time doing this. You know, if we come in at seven, eight, 9%, it is what it is, right? So I'm gonna try my best and give it my all and, uh, and that's it. And then from here, you know, it can only get better. So if I do this again next year, uh, you know, we can come in a lot harder. I'll, I'll know what to do and what not to do and all that good stuff. So anyway, that's gonna be the update for this one. Uh, we'll, I'm not sure if I'll do like an 11 week, or maybe we'll just start doing these every two weeks, um, that might be better. So, so anyway, look out for the next one. And uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, bleep bloop them down below and we'll see you guys on the next one. Cheers.